What's up everyone, it's your boy Sleepy Boy here back at it again with another Corrupted Kingdoms. Yup, if you're new to this channel or you're not, continue supporting it by either, you know subscribing, liking, commenting, and watch this video pretty much. Let's get back to it. I believe we... I have not saved. There we go. I believe that we have to go to Jessica's office. Talk to Jessica. Okay, here we go. Hotel Trivago. Hi, Jessica. Do you have a minute? <laughs> oh, God, it's so creepy. Hi, Jessica. Do you have a minute? Oh, hello again, sweetie. Always lovely to see you. Likewise. Hey, uh... Remember when I said I hadn't been sleeping well? Of course, sweetie. Is that why you're here? Can I do anything to help? Actually, you can. I hope. See, I went back to my flat and poked around, and I think it's the boiler that's been making the weird noises I mentioned. Oh, the boiler? She seems relieved for some reason. Hmm. Yeah, it's making this sort of clanking, groaning noise. Would you like me to call the plumber in, sweetie? Oh no, that's okay. I'm quite handy, you know. But I don't want to mess, it, mess with it without going over the manual first. I was wondering if you had it somewhere in your files. Oh, I'm sure we do. Let me see if I can find it. Okay, that's Jessica's dis- Now that Jessica is distracted, now for the guard. Hopefully, he's one of those conscientious employees, always eager to help. And I mean, apparently, she's pretty important in their little organization, so... Ma'am, can I be of assistance? Bingo bongo, haha. <laughs> oh, yes, please, Kevin, if you wouldn't mind. I can't quite reach. Okay, I'll only have a few seconds. Rip the package, pour in the powder. Done. Back without anyone. A few seconds. Damn. Literally. Wow. Did they go to the back rooms or something? And back without anyone noticing. Phew. Found it. Sorry to keep you waiting, sweetie. Oh no, not at all. Thank you for finding this. I'm sure I'll sleep like a baby tonight. The stress is certainly exhausting. Come on, drink it. Damn you. Is there anything else I can help you with, sweetie? Shiza, got to keep Jessica talking until the laxatives take effect. Well, I mean, if you're not too busy. I'm never too busy for you, dear. I was actually wondering how you knew my mom. She, well, she didn't really talk about this place much. You know, after... Oh, of course, sweetie. I'd happy to talk about your mom. She was my best friend, you know. Yeah, you keep repeating that. That's kind of weird. Really? Oh yes, we met in... Oh, it must have been kindergarten. She's faking it. We made a sandcastle together in the playground. And from that moment on, we were inseparable. Oh, this is Cap. This is so Cap. Did you not have a better script, woman? Uh-oh, bingo. Wow, so you knew her back when she was a baby almost. Haha, <laughs> I guess you could say that. Oh, we were quite the pair. We too. I'm sure you were. Looks like those laxatives are taking effect. About time, too. Ouch, poor guy. Looks like he's really feeling it. I almost feel sorry for him. You really must come by the house one day, sweetie. We can have a lovely chat about your mom. Oh, I missed her so much when she left. She didn't leave. She was driven out. Mm. And you know more about it than you're letting on, you, hypocri you hypocritical. I loved you. It'd be nice to talk to someone who know her, who knew her. I was so young back then, so I don't really have many memories. I understand. Oh, I'm sorry, ma'am, but I need to. I have. I'll be right back. Oh, poor Kevin. Is he all right? Oh yes, he just has a very sensitive tummy. Poor dear, he probably overdid it with the curry again. I've told him again and again, but he and his brothers. Oh well, boys will be boys. Indeed, indeed, they will. <laughs> I should get going myself and leave you to your work. I've already taken up too much of your time. Oh, sweetie, don't be silly. You know you're all welcome to stop by and chat anytime you like. I appreciate that, Jessica. And I'm serious about stopping by the house, you know. Sure you are. Hmm. I know, I appreciate it. Goodbye for now, then. Let's go for the handshake. Now, sweetie, don't be silly. Your mother was always like a sister to me. So give your auntie a hug. Or a hug. A hug works too. 
Hmm, there, that's much better. See, Auntie knows best. <laughs> she really doesn't. Gotcha. Control! Boom! We got her. That's the shot, baby. Hit me up with that shot. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Jessica. This is weird. Her eyes. It looks like she's not fully under control. Is she resisting somehow? Even Veronica didn't react like this. Jessica. Yes, sweetie. She seems under... I don't have much time before the guard gets back, but perhaps I should, I should test her. Then again, she's either under or she isn't. And either way, I need to try and get answers out of her. Yay, scary big boob lady is yours! Oh, there you are. You've been quiet. Well, it's like a small room and I was being stealthy. And you're scared of Jessica. No, shut up, dummy. <laughs> okay, what do we do now? No, let's just go with the questions. There's no time to fully take advantage of this situation. I have no idea of how long the guard's going to stay on the toilet, but I can't take any risks at this point. Not when I'm so close to answers. What questions do you have, sweetie? Let Aunt Jessica help. The control has really brought, th brought this aunt thing out in full force, it seems. It's weird. It's almost like I'm awakening something in people when I use this deep power on them. Oh well, something to think about later. For now. Jessica. Aunt Jessica. Is she insisting? She's not reacting normally to control at all. Better humor her. No point in risking her breaking free completely. Sorry, Aunt Jessica. You've been keeping secrets from me. No. Yes, you have. And a good aunt doesn't keep secrets from her nephew? Wow, that's weird to say. Whatever works, I guess. I... So I'm going to ask you some questions and you're going to answer honestly, alright? I... Yes, sweetie. Feels like a tidal wave just rose up in her mind. Whatever's in there, she's not going to give it up easily. And I can't force her or she'll break free completely. I'm just going to go have to go slow and get what I can for now. If I need, I can always do this again another day. I'm... I work in real estate. Full crap. Now Jess, I mean Aunt Jessica, we both know that's a lie. But I... I really do! Uh, maybe, but that's not your only job now, is it? Aunt Jessica, be honest with your nephew, please! I'll never get used to calling myself that. No. No what? No, it's not, it's not my only job. And what is her other job? Oh, her mind is really pushing back. It's like standing in a wind tunnel. It's some kind of organization, isn't it? Y yes Okay, progress. Slight, but anything's better than nothing. About your husband, Aunt Jessica. He... He's just my husband. Oh no, he's not just anything, is he? I know he works with you, and I know he's interested in me. Why? He... I can't. She's really fighting back the tussle. It's like trying to push through an ocean of mud. Aunt Jessica, please. He thinks you are different. Dangerous. Others, they don't know. They, they're interested in you. And you? What do you think? I don't know. Have to watch you. Protect you. I don't, I don't know. I can feel the self-conflict tearing at her mind. Obligation to her organization wearing with her auntie instincts or something else. There's something in there. It feels like guilt. Shame. But why? No, I can't. It's alright. It's alright, Aunt Jessica. Damn it. Just mentioning it has to put her right on the edge of breaking free. I doubt I'll get much from her, but I have to try. I already know about the organization and that you work for them. And your husband too, right? I... It's okay, I already know. Yes. Good, and they're interested in me. Yes. Why? No, I won't. Crap. Okay, okay, it's okay, just relax. Everything's fine. Can you tell me who or what else they're interested in? I, I can't. Damn it, I'm getting nowhere. I'm going to have to just throw ideas out and see what lands. What about the church? Oh, yes, you know already. Oh, yes, that's okay. I already know, so you're not betraying any secrets. Okay. I wonder if they know about Morgana. Better not mention her by name, though. What about the woods? Stay away. Dangerous. 
Don't I know it? Stay away! Okay, 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 calm down, it's alright, relax. Too dangerous, too dangerous! They know, they suspect, if they see you go in there. Like your mom, why did she go in there? Wait, what? Asler! My mother went into the woods, into Morgana's woods. Did Morgana know about my mother? Pixie! I don't know, I never heard about this, I promise. Morgana hadn't even made me yet. Ask about your mother. Always walking outside town, she wouldn't stay still. So much energy, so much life, so much heart. Too much, too much. Don't tell me she was made into an artifact. What do you mean, too much heart? What does that mean? I... Tell me! She was too kind, she wanted to help them. But the organization, they... The organization, what about them? What did they have to do with my mother? Asler, they couldn't let her, don't you see? They couldn't. She had so much heart, but she wouldn't have she would have destroyed everything. They 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 had to. Had to had to what? Huh? Had to what? No, I can't, I can't! Aster, stop, you're going to Push her. Tell me! I can't! What the F did you people do to her? Asler! I can't! Tell me! I can't! I can't! No, I can't! God damn it! Tell me no! I can't! I can't! I can't! I can't! I can't. Tell me right effing now or I'll swear I'll... I, I'm sorry, Asler. Pixie, you hit me! I didn't know what else to do! What? I... <sighs> I know you were just trying to protect me. I lost control. Get it? Because I'm using the power control? <laughs> and if Jessica had broken free, well... Anyway, I'm sorry if I scared you. It's... it's okay. I'm not going to get anything else out of Jessica though. And there's no time left anyway. The guard will be back any second now. But I need the safeguards, so... Jess. That is, Aunt Jessica. Y yes It's alright, there's nothing to be nervous about. Just relax. Everything is fine now. Oh, okay. You know how special my mom was? Yes. And now I'm alone in the world, no family. Well, except Gramps, but it's not bringing him up. Yes. Don't you think family is important? Family, huh? Nothing beats family. To have people who can care for you and protect you and keep you from harm. Yes, you need family. You know I'm not dangerous, I'm not what your husband thinks I am. I'm just the orphan son of your best friend, lost and alone in the world. Yes. I need family, perhaps an aunt, perhaps you, Aunt Jessica. We're only 13 minutes in, interesting. Might as well make her odd fixation work for me. Yes. Yes. Yes, you need Aunt Jessica to look after you, take care of you. Wow, that one slid in with no trouble at all. Why was it only this command she didn't try to resist? My husband is wrong. You're a good boy. A good boy. My good boy. Okay. I'll protect you. Love you. Okay, uh, hon. Good. That's great. Thank you. Uh, and Jessica. Phew. Okay. Well, this didn't really go as planned. Still, it's obvious there's even more to this organization than I thought. And they had something to do with my mother. I need to learn more. I could control Jessica again, but she reacted so strangely to it this time. Perhaps I should do a little digging first. I have no leads on the organization, but perhaps if I try to get it at if I try to get at it through Jessica's hus husband, there may be some kind of paper trail or digital footprint I can follow to the organization. We can but hope. For now though, I'd best release Jessica before the guard gets back and notices anything. But the boom bada beam, everything is normal. Uh thanks for your help, Jessica. And for the chat. Aha, uh -huh, sweetie. Sorry. It's Aunt Jessica, remember? Oh ha, uh, yes, yeah, sorry, Aunt Jessica. I guess that's stuck, huh? <laughs> Much better! <laughs> now come on, give your aunt a hug and then off you go, huh? I'm sure you have a lot to think about. I... Oh, alright, that's me. Oh, yeah, I certainly do. Mmm, there's a brave boy. I'll see you later, sweetie. Sure, see you around, Aunt Jessica. What a weirdo, man. 
afternoon. I think we can work. What are our leads? Supermarket, Emma, laptop. I should re research him on my lap laptop at home. I'll have to wait. So it's the research part, I see. That's the only thing we can do. But it's 15 minutes in, so I'm gonna end this. I'm gonna end this channel. No. I'm gonna end this video right here. Please subscribe, like, comment, continue supporting this channel by watching my videos or other videos or you can comment down below you can comment on what other game you're interested in that i could play you know it will be like a walkthrough i'll be we'll, we'll literally be playing or i'm we're all gonna be holding hands together pretty lewd isn't it but yeah other than that thank you for watching again greatly appreciated see you in the next episode bye